and hello everybody, welcome back to another Let's Play for the Spongebob Scrappings. It's better for beginning, but I'm getting all the 100 gold spatulas. This is your lovely Subsonic. And in the last part, we started up Spongebob's dream. And we got it off shortly because this won't take that very long. So now we are going to continue Spongebob's dream with the Squidward's dream. So we can annoy the pest out of him, which is always fun. For heaven's sake, boy, cover your ears. Mr. Krabs? What are you doing in Squidward's dream? Hard time, boy. Or at least it feels like it. Do you think you can make it across this sheet of music to the golden spatula on Squidward's big nose? Don't worry, Mr. Krabs. I'll end this challenge on a high note. Uh, good luck, boy. When you get there, try to wake him up. I'm running out of aspirin. Yep, he sure loves himself. Because all all those pictures of him are lying around, and horrible music as well. Just uh, if you step on these, you can hear some fun music notes. And I don't know if it's correctly to the um, actual tone ladder, but it's it's points for for God's sake. It's not like it's supposed to be uh, uh, educated or anything. So, and we get ourselves a ooh false notes over here. These will fall down if you step on them. Could show it if I'm in a safe location, but not over here. I could show that one off, I guess. There's one stuck for us to collect over here as well. So we go back there, and not for fall off. And this one is actually moving, this so, this so. You gotta maneuver your way through these notes and make a fun song. And I survived. This one is more difficult because it has notes flying all around the tone ladder. Go all the way over there, and here again, over there, nothing fun to say, and, and you could see the suck up there, how wondering how, how they are supposed to get it, I will show you in a moment, if I make it, if I survive it, yeah it is survive. So, get the shiny object, and land over here, sweet, just wait for a moment, this won't fall off, just wear close to this, can we get a blue shiny object, sure or not. Bouncing all the way over there. So lots of bouncing. Gotta love it. Let's take a look. Or she suckers over there. Yeah. Seems pretty obvious I don't need to get it. Though. So you need to bounce your way through on this platform. Just follow the platform, follow it, keep following it. And get the suck. And I missed. And I fell down. Nothing has worked in this part. This is just great. I feel oh, it's pretty dark outside. Whoops, not yet. Okay, now, now we need to do this. Mm, dunk. Squidward sure has a big dream. Yep. Can they just s stop staring around? We have work to do. We have specialists to collect. Very important specialists. So keep bouncing on the platforms and bouncing on the notes. Tone ladder has never been this fun before. Learning music has never been this fun before because we have a giant tone ladder and Squidward. Both best combination ever. <laughs> this time we actually have to jump down to get that um, sock. Just not a jackpot for us to pick up there so we can do that as well, or like that. And then let's pick a sock up. So we got only one sock form. We only got one sock remaining. Whoops. We only got one sock remaining. Yay! And I know where that is. So. We got all the socks for Patrick! All 80 of them! Wooty woopty woot. So just keep on bouncing. Kadoom! Or do 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 Keep your votes coming for the next LP for after SpongeBob. Which after this part, I think this is the I we'll need to do some backtracking and all of that and beat the final boss and how long the final boss is going to take. I will show how to get... Nah, not. Yeah, I think I know what to do. I think it's two more parts after this. Uh, it's one part me showing off uh, all the spatulas I need to get for the final one. And showing off the 40,000 shiny objects uh, thing. And in the last part I'm going to beat the final boss and get the two final spatulas. Yeah, they should work. So after this part, this is part 21 I believe. Whoops, a bit too early. Just keep bouncing, it should be returning. 
Yep, there it is. And no, wait, just wait. Don't jump onto early. About now. Should do a trick. Go here. So I checked. Ah, I dared. So and doesn't really change because I come hi and low and we're close to the end. So there's Squidward with his big ass nose. Big ass nose. I need to go to this one. Ooh. Uh, need to platform my skills for this because you always fall. Now we're close to it. There's the end. And this lines up over here. So am I going to get it purpose and empty? Yes, I am. Because I am daredevil like that. Big ass nose! Look at his nose, it's humongous! No Zilla. And I make it up some nose and get switched off Squidward's nose. Oh nose. Ah, funny. So, skip me off here, and go in the box, and get out of here because it's boring me! Okay. Aha, I'm going behind the fence. And I went through the fence. Okay, it didn't make any sense at all, but oh well. You don't have to. So, uh, next up is Mr. Krabs' dream. This one is, whoops, went down a little bit way too fast. This can be quite difficult if you don't know what to do, but it seems I made it just fine. There's one of those uh, robots over there. Which I missed completely. Just wait a bit. Wait a little bit way to the left. Oh, it's the way to the left. Let's go around here and hit him in the face. Right in the face. The face. And percent protect. Sweet. So and now you're running. Where is Quitter in all this? Well you just missed Crash Stream. Yeah, let's pay the final thousands shiny up this guy I need to pay. To continue on over to Petford Stream later on. But first we gotta go to Mr. Crab's Dream, which is basically a robot endurance round. But we got Squidward over there as well. Squidward, this is amazing. Amazingly awful, you mean. Mr. Krabs is dreaming of the Krusty Krab. What a surprise. I can't escape work anywhere. Whoa! Lunch rush! I better grab my hat and forget the hat! Get that spatula and get us out of here! It's like a shiny golden toothpick that holds together the bun of... We don't have time for this! Yep. Squidward, always fun as usual. This was a unique up concept because you have these giant patties and if each, if you destroy one robot each, one of these slices will go out. So that's basically what we need to do. This is quite a, this is quite pretty difficult uh, endurance round because you don't have many unawares to pick up. And those can be quite difficult, these ones, and everything is go around you and go the first one. Okay, just made it in time. Okay, it seems we can go destroy this one first because we destroyed enough of those. And let's go kill this duplicate from stupid annoying machine so those guys won't be bothering us anymore. Those ones are the most annoying, those big ass robots. You can destroy them easily by two bubble balls. Ugh, pissing me off, robot. Oh, Jesus. We're firing us everywhere. Ugh, okay. Time out. Time out. Time out for God's sake. Ugh. Okay, just have a piece of rest for one second. Please. Care not, guy, have a moment of rest, please. Boink. Okay, we just to find and go destroy this one. Destroy them all. Destroy them all. Bear from nowhere. Oh, just three. Jesus. And we can make it up over there, so carefully maneuver our way over there. Don't get anybody. Okay, good. That's good. I guess this should be also a great grinding spot if you want to get up as robots. It's quite difficult if you want to survive. So, all the robots are down, so let's take them out one by one. So first, this one. And the one over there. Okay, we're now just along with this one. You should be able to get rid of him quite easily. Sweet. Now for this. And whoops, I missed the middle one. And the bottom one. So over here and over there. And the last one is over here, so we're good. I think it's the last one. Is it the last one? Yeah, it is. Yay, go on special! And I believe the soccer is something. Oh, 
I think it's around here somewhere. I believe it's on the back side of this. It's somewhere under here. Need to focus a little bit on the other side. And lots of money, 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 and a bar at the top. It's weird. Never noticed it before. And lots of money, 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 and there's the last sock for Patrick. Number 80. The last one. Now we've officially gotten all the socks for Patrick, so you can applaud that all the all the hell you want. But most importantly, we got a golden spatula, so let's pick this up and go to the next part. And in the... Okay, not really. It's way too short, 10 minutes. Way too short for my standards. Number 80, we only got two more spatulas to pick up, which is fairly easily. What do you have to say about it, Squidward? Finally! Now we can leave! But first, I need my paycheck. Miss Crab! Excuse me! Miss Crab! Yeah, he wants paycheck, of course, you... Lee likes money as well. Paycheck! Money, 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 money! Okay, anyway. Let's go get that final two golden spatulas. And you may look at this, this is quite difficult. Because there's a lot of... Spikies! I got impaled by spikes. But we got plenty of um, socks, uh, socks, unaware. Let's take a look which one's going to... This one, and we made it just fine. So let's get our... Let's go do Patrick 3 and let's see what... Amazing things Patrick has a dream about. Let's take a look. Wow. Nothing much. Just like any cartoon. So let's go talk to Patrick. Patrick, you have a golden spatula. Give it here. Not so fast, SpongeBob. You'll have to pass my test before you get this golden spatula. Very well, sir. Challenge accepted. Very well. Your challenge is... To find the golden spatula! You're holding it. You did it! Now here is your reward. Um, easiest challenge ever! Yay! Now we get another golden spatula for Patrick, the always fun star. Our favorite star in the game. Well, it's the only star in the game. Well, Starfish. You can walk all the way over there you want, but nothing will happen. Just walk aimlessly. Just keep on walking backwards. And you will end up here eventually. Let's take a look forward. Nothing. Just keep on walking forward. Nothing will happen. And then we cut back over here. So there's an infinite loop. You can walk out all the way you want, but nothing will happen. So let's go back out to SpongeBob Stream and finish up this level. And it's already over. Aww. Yes, yeah, my favorite level is already over. Pretty quickly! Haha! Ha. I thought you could escape my grasp, can't you? Die! Super robot. And get a box of here. And get our final golden special of this level. Number 82. And we can also 82 deliver to Patrick, which is number 98. Then? Wow, that's a lot, I know. Um, so 90, I believe. So, and let's go to the box. And go exit this level. Hi Gary, bye Gary, and go back to Bikini Bottom. Just wake up, call for SpongeBob SquarePants. So, and that concludes this part for today. So if you can take a look, we've got all the golden spatulas in every single level. Except the ones for Patrick and Mr. Krabs, and the Chum Bucket. Which is going to be in the last part anyway. So, um... In the next part, I will be giving Mr. Krabs and Patrick their stuff. And I will show you the uh, 40,000 shiny objects aboard. So, before looking to the almost conclusion of SpongeBob SquarePants. So, I'm going to stand next to Bobbody because he's awesome. Hi, Bobbody. Well, how about we go stand on the Krusty Krab? Yeah, it's always fun. Well, at least spring is not here, so I'm going to squirt. Um, it's gonna be one place to stand front and front for. Uh, let's go stand on these tikis. Yeah, go stand on the tikis. So, in the next part, I'm going to do the Miss Krabs, Patrick, 40,000 shiny objects pre bar. So, thank you for watching. This is your lovely Super Sonic signing off. See you then. See you at the next part.